Hi, I'm Travis Green, and this is Bob Bentley, and together we're part of the product team for NetIQ Identity Manager. Bob, I understand we have a new capability to demonstrate for our Identity Manager customers. That's right, Travis. We've built a new user interface for Identity Manager called Identity Manager Home. And this is a tool that's designed for business users, not administrators. Right, so Identity Manager Home is meant for business users, but does that mean that administrators have lost functionality? No, actually, we've kept everything in place that's already there. This is an additional user interface for end users. So everything administrators have been used to doing through the user app and designer and tools like that, it's all still there. Now, when you say business user, what type of interactions do we expect them to make with Identity Manager Home? Well, there's five primary things that your average end user needs to do in the business. One of them is to find a resource that they need for doing their job. Right. Um, they also need to submit requests for those resources. And so if they um, you know, need to initiate a request, this is how they do it. Um, they also might want to be able to see what they've currently got access to so they can avoid re-requesting things that they may already have. If you're a manager, um, then you need to review, uh, review those requests and approve them. And, um, and finally, you, know, you need to see the progress of requests that have been made. Is it stuck in anybody's inbox? What am I waiting for? When is it going to be here? Things like that. Where it's at in the process. Right. Yeah, so that's great. So are these new capabilities in Identity Manager? They kind of sound familiar. They should sound familiar because they've been there forever. They've been there ever since the beginning. Uh, but the feedback we've gotten from users is that they really would like these to be available in a much more basic and direct way than what we've done before. So this is a new um, UI we've developed from ground up to be able to make that presentation and uh, you know, that user interaction much more capable. And really what we're trying to do is to take this out of the hands of IT and put it more into the hands of the business users. Right, so the IT is not so much a, uh, a decision maker, they're more of a facilitator. That's exactly our philosophy, that the IT should focus on their job of making sure people get access to what they need, but it's the, it's the users and, the, and their managers who really make the decisions about who should get access to what. I see, so this should actually help reduce support costs right. if IT no longer has that on their plate. That's right. How are we going to get this out into the hands of customers? Well, the good news for Identity Manager customers is that if you are a current Identity Manager customer, version 4, advanced edition, this is free, uh, no charge download for you. Okay. What about Identity Manager 3 or Standard Edition customers? For those customers, they'll need to talk to their account teams about moving up to the most current version, getting that installed, getting it patched up and, and uh, you know, with the latest downloads and all that. And they need to be Advanced Edition also, not Standard Edition. Okay, great. Well, why don't we take a look at this new interface? Sounds great. Let's do it.